everybody today we're going to discuss an important question in our mark room which is what are macro molecules give examples okay so how you should answer this is first of all any macro molecule is of course a chemical compound now they are found in the acid insoluble fraction now this is like making tea okay so when you make tea uh, when you mix the tea powder in the milk, what happens? Whatever essence will dissolve in the milk will go into the milk. But the powder that does not dissolve, what will happen? It will remain on the top in the retentate, correct? So those when you digest it with the acid so those molecules that cannot be broken down uh, by the acid okay will be found in the top in the retentate which are nothing but our macro molecules okay and what are the examples of macro molecules any high weight polymer okay which is all your proteins carbohydrates okay and then uh, nucleic acids all of these are polymeric substances means what they are not just a single molecule this is made up of so many so many smaller molecules called a monomer and they all join hands to form this bigger molecule okay so because all of these others are polymeric substances they will be found in the macromolecule category now if you look at lipids okay now all this lipid uh, is found in the cells membrane structure so when you break the membrane what happens the membrane doesn't dissolve completely it will basically be formed like chunks okay so these chunks cannot dissolve and they don't pass down into the uh, filtrate but otherwise if you look at the weight they are very less molecular weight only but because of their structural component you will find them also along with the other retentate in the acid insoluble fraction okay so except lipids all of the others are very high weight macromolecules are polymeric substances but lipid is not so remember this and definitely do subscribe the channel and follow for more such mark room questions all the best